everyone! Roxas here, welcome you to episode number 33 of our Pokemon Shining Pearl comparison Let's Play. On the last episode, we uh, got all the way here, we got rid of uh, the Psydogs that were blocking the way, and now we're going to explore this uh, foggy area, but because we use Defog, it's no longer foggy for us, so haha. <laughs> so yeah, uh, in between episodes I went back and healed because Cozy was... Uh, I don't want to say injured, but uh, fainted <laughs> by these two people because they created Cozy. Yeah, annoyed them. So yeah, <laughs> we also got uh, Bit Extras uh, to evolve into an Ambipom, so I'm really happy about that. And now let's just continue and see what we can do. You seem to have a lot of confidence, and uh, let's see if it's uh, justified. Oh, I like how the background looks. Like the mountains. Ernest. Mathem. I could have actually also gotten a Mothem. But I think uh, Wormadam is a little bit better. And Mothem is a part flying, I, and I already have a Togetic for that. So, yeah. I think this is going to be your last. Wow! With just one hit. Okay. Onyx. Okay, you're gonna be a little bit harder to take out. Level 26. Wow, thank you for doing like that step up on the levels. He's going to take a while, I guess. Curse! Never mind. You know what it's time for? Oh, Shania to come in. I was gonna tell with him to maybe get some damage off. But if he's cursing, I don't think that's a battle I'm gonna win. Yeah, keep on cursing, keep on cursing. Also, something that uh, happened on the last episode, we uh, got Cynthia to... Well, Cynthia convinced us to get this old charm to her granny, so... We're gonna do that also. That's why we're going up north. To Celestic Town? I think that's a name. I might be wrong. Luxio. Intimidate. Yeah, all the Luxio that we found on other trainers are actually Intimidate. Really? I'm gonna use Ice Beam. To preserve your bubble beams. And now you get the crit. Not that it matters. Haha, <laughs> total loss for me. Okay then, so... Let's move on. Over here we got some items if I'm not mistaken. Hello? You get stuck there. Interesting. Because of the rock? I'm not gonna put another repel on. I'm pretty sure that this is a ninja, I guess. A ninja can use all sorts of cool techniques. Like what? All I've seen you do is hide. Dust Ox. Oh, I forgot to get a rid of... Bit extra slot to lead. You know what? Cozy has confusion, so let's do that. Ha ha ha! see how much confusion does. Light screen! Right. You get the screens. Wow, that did nothing. That's the only Pokemon you have. Pokemon is resisted. 
Let's see, if you do some damage, I'm gonna Metal Burst. Each life, okay. That's not gonna do much, but I guess it's something. So, cool thing to note is that Leech Life is actually on this game. I guess I do more with the confusion. Now I'm just gonna Quiver Dance until we're faster, so that when the light screen comes off, I can just confusion instead of him using an again the light screen. I think that's this is the last turn. Oh, I'm faster already. Okay. So I'm just gonna start confusing confusioning <laughs> now. Each life again. Okay, let's see. With him Lich Lighty. Okay, that was some decent damage. It was kind of like a fourth of its total HP. Once the light screen's off, I think I might kill now. My quick out collisions on my head, yes, haha. <laughs> Cozy. <laughs> War Madame sweeping. Actually, that's one of the <laughs> issues I have. Well, not issues, but one of the goals I have with uh, Gozi is him to set up and take out one of the Elite Four members. Psybeam! It's better than Confusion, so... Is it? Yeah. Ah, a little bit. Gozi, Gozi, Gozi. Night Slash! Have knock off. Night Slash is technically better. Better. Okay, I am gonna do this. Because I'm hoping they're dropping eyeballs now. If it doesn't, I'm just gonna box her. Ninja boy, my ninja techniques failed to work. Sorry, boy. Nope. At what level do you evolve at? No, wait. So let's go to the Pokemon. I don't want you to be over level, Drapina. So sorry. You go to the box. You're stronger now than Mar. Oh, same level as Marisa. Uh, should I box the Saber? I'm gonna box Saber just. Okay. This is good. I don't want them to get over leveled. <laughs> and again, Saber just needs the evolutionary stone to evolve. Hold on. Sorry, Ami Bomb. Okay, now I remember. I also wanted to do this. Swap for Oceania. Wow. Oceania takes a while. Shadow Ball! Ooh. I'm pretty sure Marisa can learn it by level up, so I'm not gonna waste the team, especially since these TMs are not reusable. Yeah, the glitch steer there. I don't know if you watch it. That sometimes a different scene comes on. But I restarted the program and everything, so I don't know. I might need to restart the whole computer. <laughs> Anyways, this buff hit physique isn't the just for show. Oh no! Black Belt Adam! My choke! Okay. 
bubble beam. I think actually the audio is on sync with the Let's Play. So that's something different from the last episode. Yeah, it's actually synced up. But the glitch kinda happens. Not as often as in the last episode, but. Yeah, in the comments, please tell me if that's happening. Well, when, I, when I'm editing, I'm gonna notice it, so. Okay. I know that that, that thingy is going to be a ninja. Yes. Wow, so many trainers. We ninjas appear where you least expect us. Okay, so here are available Pokemon Psyduck, Machop, Machoke, Bibarel, Meditite, Hoot and Noctowl. By fishing, Magikarp, Magikarp, and Barbooch. Barbooch is a Gen 3 bot, right? Because Gen 2 was Quasire. Oh, are you dry skin? Let's not figure that out. Bye bye. It's just that you're so strong that maybe... Yeah, I'm gonna put Cozy in the front of the party. I already got the outfit that I wanted for the amulet coin, so... Wow, Saibi was going to demolish his team. Now that I think of it, I don't have a psychic type on my rotation team. Wait, what am I talking about, Saber? Duh. Ninja Boy Nathan. I'm sorry, Ninja Boy. You didn't expect to lose. And they give me a little money, so... Uh, excuse me, Bidextrous, can you please move away? I want to get the item, I don't want to talk to you. No! <laughs> Bidextrous! <sighs> okay, come here now, let me walk around you. Haha! Smoke World! That's for fleeing from battle, right? I think it is. Okay. Yeah, but you're a bird keeper. Okay. This is gonna be you, and then I'm gonna switch you to the end. I'll teach you how about the charms of a bird Pokemon. Bird keeper Brianna. Hoot hoot. Let's Okay, good, good, and knocked out. The baby and the evolution. Wow, you took that. Nice. Extra sensory. Okay, now it's time to ball so I'll do. Oh, Jesus Christ. Wow, I'm a. I admit, I'm quite impressed. Surprised! Sorry, whatever. I don't know my words. Okay, so we have to do two things. First, let's move everyone one to the side. And let's get you here. Okay! The next one to be Fox is gonna be a bit extra. But... Okay, the items there. Ooh. Wait, I didn't put Cozy in the front. I guess that item, I don't get it unless I have a Surf, because I didn't see. Better Brian. Weasel. Really? Okay, so let's... 
You know what? Let's go into cozy and quiver dance on his face. Tail whip. Okay, that's not nice. What's your ability, Cozy? Anticipation, okay. And let's see how much this Psybeam does. Wow, with one Quiver Dance, I'm faster and I want to shot. Interesting. <laughs> Cozy is becoming one of my favorite Pokemon <laughs> to use. Machoke! Haha! <laughs> Haha! <laughs> You're so dead. If I one shot the Puzzle, I one shot you, Machoke. Yeah. Although you're an evolved uh, Pokemon, you're not a full evolved, and uh, you're weak to Psychic. Gee, era parigue. I'm gonna bug bite. She might take the Psybeam. Oh. Just one Quiver Dance. Imagine simple quiver dance? Wow, that would be so wild. Simple shell smash! Wow! The power of youth, it's startling. Okay. Okay, so I can get uh, these uh, berries. Aqua berries. Uh, on the walkthrough, after. Uh, that explanation it's just a an explanation of uh, the people that we can battle and after that it doesn't say anything so I guess we just have to keep on exploring okay before I head into town because I think that this is yeah this is the entrance of the town Oh, not only that, we need waterfall. Not only surf, we need to waterfall to get around. Okay, so never mind. Item, you stay there. Uh, later, I'll come back for you. Uh, my Pokemon aren't that damaged, and I don't think. We battle anyone here. But yeah, uh, just three Pokemon. <laughs> no, 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 fight, thank you. <clears throat> they say this town uh, has been here since the Sinnoh was made. We have to check that on uh, Pokemon Legends Arceus. What would bring you to a place so far off uh, the beaten path? Uh, there's nothing to see here but uh, some ancient Pokemon etching. Oh, now this is interesting. Let me see your Pokemon. It clearly likes you very much. You can have this! Wow. Thank you, I guess. It's about uh, the trust between the trainer and the, the Pokemon. Developing trust in each other is the key to victory. I don't think that with uh, just trust that you can... Oh! You can trigger the story! <laughs> I was gonna say beat the odds or succeed, but yeah. There's an odd spaceman in front of the ruins. There isn't anything there, but that only seemed to make him angry. He's saying he will blow the town up with a bomb. The nerve of it all. If only I were younger, I'd punish that spaceman with my Pokemon. Are you the granny? We, can we get the shaming already? Ooh. So, Dialga and Valkia are both here. Interesting. I'm gonna keep on 
I'm gonna keep on exploring the map and then this story I think I'm gonna do on the next episode. Hey, do you know what they say? They say a Pokemon created the Sino region. Not just the Sino region, but everything, but okay. Ha, Pini! Pini, ha! Okay. <laughs> I must bear down and train, and for that time is, and for that time is unimportant. Therefore, I have no need for a watch. Take these for me. What? I already ha have a watch. Okay. The analog watch app displays the current time. I guess that's one new app for the phone. I'm pretty sure this is Celestic Town. Hello! Putting on a pair of glasses uh, changes how the world looks. Trying off a pair of glasses changes how the world looks too, Deep Man. So, would you like to change how the world looks to your Pokémon? Ow! Oh, okay. I guess I can give that to Drapion once it evolves. Black glasses raise the power of the type moves. He said something else, but I don't think it was that important. Welcome, may I help you? I'm here to buy. Oh! I guess I don't need anything right now. Nothing, I'm fine. Thank you, lady. You're so nice. Welcome, how may I help you? Okay, so you sell. <gasps> Quick balls! Wow, I have a lot of money. Okay, no. <laughs> I want to buy 120 quick balls. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Okay, I'm gonna buy 10 of these. If you only had... Heavy balls. To come again. Thank you. Now I know where to buy the quick balls. I hope I don't forget. There is no mart in this town, instead you can buy and sell items in the house right next to me. I guess it's the same as the mart, but more of a local kind of thing. Where are you from? Hmm, Twinleaf Town, you say. Isn't that close to Lake Verity? That lake is said to be home to Mesprit, the being of emotion. It must be looking over you. I guess so. My big sister is studying the myths of Sinnoh. She wants to know how people and Pokemon interacted in the days of myths. So your sister is Cynthia? Were things different back then, or were they the same as now? She says that's the focus of her research. Can I read this? It's an old book, you began reading it. When that Pokemon was born, intelligence bloomed among us, enriching our lives. When that Pokemon was born, emotions bloomed among us, giving us joy and sorrow. When that Pokemon was born, willpower bloomed among us, spurring into, spurring us into action. So, Oxia Selva and Mesprit, that's what these are saying. It's not about Dialga and Palkia. Hello. Howdy, starting up on the local history. I guess. If I climb to the top of a Mount Coronet, I will be able to see all of Sino. Will I be able to solve Sino? Maybe. Mount Coronet towers at the center of a Sino. In a way, it's the closest place to the sky in this region. Okay, so I guess now it's time to talk to the guy. We still haven't delivered the, the old charm. This town is insignificant. There's nothing of value here. It doesn't need it to exist. So I'll blow it up with a galactic bomb. If you try to mess with me, I'll shut you down with a Pokemon battle. So what's it going to be? Are you going to mess with me? Ah, uh, yes. You dare to oppose Team Galactic. That means you're taking on the world. No, the universe, even. Okay. Okay, so I guess I can continue uh, reading while we battle this grunt. 
Celestic Town is a small town, there is no Pokémon, but the house in the north the west functions as the Pokémon. Kill your Pokémon before proceeding. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna ice in the beautifully. Near the stairs, an old woman will tell you that a spaceman wants to blow up the town due to him thinking it is not important. Go down the stairs and then head north and you'll find a tip galactic front. Standing in the front of Celestic Ruins. Of the Celestic Ruins entrance, talk to him. Then say yes to battle him. After you win, he will leave and the world... Oh, okay. So that's a little bit of a spoiler. But I guess I can continue reading. After you win, he will leave and the old woman will come and talk to you. Give you the old... Talk to you. Give the old charm to her. She will introduce herself as Cynthia's grandmother, then tell you to go inside the ruins. Okay, so then we have to get into the Celestic Ruins, but we'll not... I don't think we're gonna do that until the next episode, so... I just got worked over. And by a kid, no less. Because you're weak. And pathetic. <laughs> Too much to handle. Whatever, I'm out of this one horse town. There's nothing good to do here anyways. Uh, goodbye. Well, aren't you quite the trainer? That was magnificent. As the elder of Celestic Town, I give you my thanks. Oh, that old charm. May I see that, dear? What's that? You say Cynthia entrusted you to deliver it to... Entrusted you with it to deliver to me? That's Cynthia. She's my granddaughter. I handed over the old charm to the elder. This old charm is something made in Celestic Town long, long ago. It was made in honor of a mythical deity said to have created Sino. These old charms are still discovered now and again. Since you're in Celestic Town, why not look around inside the ruins? But guess what? Now we're gonna do that on the next episode, because for now I'm gonna wrap it up and see what we can find in there. I guess we prevented this uh, town being blown up. But that's just regular manners. <laughs> But yeah, for now that's it. <laughs> Thank you for watching, leave a like if you did, and it's time to trap it all. Bye bye!